everybody, welcome to the Winds of Jupiter daily card and horoscope reading. Now we have Mars Quincunx Sharon, and Mars is the warrior, the aggressive influence, and Sharon is the wounded healer. It's kind of shying and shrinking away, fear of rejection. And then a Quincunx is about a pulling between the two entities. And the overall energy card of the day is the Nine of Cups. The wish card. This is like getting the get out of jail free card in Monopoly. It's time to free yourself from the old wounds. It's time to heal. It's time not to worry anymore about fear of rejection. I call the Nine of Cups card, curiosity killed the cat and satisfaction brought him back. Because this card is about satisfaction, happiness and contentment. But the old idiom years ago was care killed the cat. Care meaning worry and anxiety. Now the reason they said care, because curiosity actually meant care in Latin. And it's akin to the word cure or taking care of something. And now it's time for you to take care of these old wounds. Wish your own retrograde it's time for spiritual healing from your past lives to your past experience in this life. And this is also about synchronicities, events that happen that, are, that appear coincidental but actually have significance. And with you receiving the Nine of Cups today, this is a sign that it is time to heal. It's time to give yourself the privilege of happiness and fulfillment. It's time to dip your toe in the water and start testing the waters for you to take action because the key to healing is action. You know we've all made mistakes in our life but we can't dwell on them. The word cure also means to get rid of something and here it is to get rid of what has been bothering you so you can restore yourself to good health. In the olden days, the word cure meant to actually make yourself whole. Doctors might say they cure, but in reality all they do is cover up symptoms. Now Sharon was immortal and had been wounded, and his wound would never heal. So he elected to become mortal so he could die. Now we're already mortal, and we should have the ability to heal venial things, but it's not fatal. And with the energy of Capricorn urging us to take action, realistically, we can start healing ourselves. A lot of times the wounds that we've received in life aren't even our fault. Where we're faulting at is that we hang on to them and allow ourselves to suffer. And now it's time to take the suffering away. And I wish you acceptance, peace, and happiness.